How would you like to know how to attract money fast? Sounds great, right? And of course it is. Now, if you're interested in the law of attraction and using your mind to, to get your life the way you want it, including money, then I have a question for you. Why do you think you haven't attracted all the money that you need up till now? Good question, huh? Do you think that it's because the law of attraction is a bit picky and it doesn't like you very much? Not likely, is it? Because it's a law, right? I mean, the law of gravity doesn't, doesn't behave like that. Oh, look at those people floating around. They haven't been very good. Okay, so I don't think that's the answer. And do you think there's something wrong with you? Or maybe you think the law of attraction it doesn't really exist or doesn't work. Well, we've seen it work and we've seen it work for other people. So what is it? Now, here's what I think it is. It is not, let, let me tell you what it's not. It is not because you've got some deeply buried subconscious stuff from your past. That's BS. First of all, if it's subconscious, a, how would you even know it exists? B, if it did exist, how could you ever get at it? You can bypass all of that stuff. The problem isn't what's in your subconscious, it's what you're doing consciously. And I'll tell you what 99% chance is that you're doing consciously if you don't have enough money. You're worrying about it. Now, you can't set up that energy of worry at the same time as setting up the energy of abundance and prosperity. It's not going to happen. Then they're, they're going to cancel each other out. At least, if not worse, and you'll be you'll be pulled the other way towards the negative end. So I'm Trevor Emden and I'm an NLP practitioner. I'm a law of attraction coach. I'm trained in both those things. And I was my own first guinea pig because me and money haven't always mixed well <laughs> in my life. And, uh, and, you know, I've struggled for money at times, but I've always managed to manifest it. Now, in more recent years, I've sometimes manifested it in spectacular amounts and from the most incredible unforeseeable places really <laughs> like one day I walked into the bank and there was thousands of pounds I'm British right thousands of pounds in my bank account just check my balance out of the machine a little slip of paper you know that shouldn't have been there thousands the bank was very excited they wanted to put it into an account and I said no because I need a car and my wife and I drove to one showroom and there, slap bang in the middle of their forecourt, which I hadn't even seen this car, was my dream car. My wife said, oh, look, there's your dream car. And there was a silver C-Class Mercedes. And I'd had a picture of one of those up on the, you can't see, but just there's a wall. And I'd had a picture of that very make and model and that colour on my wall for several months. I had no way of thinking how I was going to, uh, purchase such a car not in a million years wasn't even close to that amount of money and there it was the car and the money all in one day and I've since checked it was a few years ago but I've since checked where that money came from because it came from a pension fund and I didn't know why they paid it to me it was like a back payment or a I don't know I didn't know why and I thought oh it was my birthday that weekend I thought well it must be because I've reached a certain age and maybe I'm due a pay rise or increase in my pension who knows? They didn't tell me. But I've spoken to them since. <laughs> and I said, oh, you know, um, I had a little payout a few years ago. And they said, what payout was that? We have no record of that payout. I can't explain it. And I'm not going to dig any deeper because I'm driving the car that I bought with the money to this day. It's still a good car. So... And that's just one. I mean, that was a spectacular story, but I've had all kinds of windfalls and things show up. Money shows up and I trust it now. Trust it now. It doesn't mean you can just sit back and, uh, oh, I don't have to do anything. All I've got to do is imagine money and it'll just go. No, 
No, you still take action, but it's not hard work action. It's not panic action. You see, the law of attraction doesn't give you what you want. It gives you what you are. So you have to be in that state of abundance and prosperity so that you're putting that energy out and it comes back to you. It's a very simple principle. Click on the link on this video. Uh, there should be one below the video as well. Just click on the link. Um, I'll put one up in the corner uh, as well. Uh, just click on it and go and find out about my Stop Worrying and Grow Rich method because it's powerful it's very very simple to do it works very quickly and that's what you need so i'll see you there i'll see you over there click on that should be up there bye